Hey everybody, this is Unfading Silence. I just wanted to bring a quick little video talking about the upcoming changes that could possibly take place when the new chapter comes out and how it looks to me like we are about to be going into a full-on tank meta this upcoming update. So let's take a look at a few things. So the first thing I want to talk about is going to be the removal of proc sets from PvP. Yes, you heard me right. Zenimax is removing proc sets from PvP, but there is a huge catch. Actually, not really a huge catch. They will just no longer work in non-champion point campaigns. So they're no longer going to work in Battlegrounds or Imperial City if you play in non-CP PvP. If you are still playing in PvP with champion points... Do not worry, your carry me to victory proc sets will still be there and they will still work. But along the lines of the removal of proc sets, there is also another thing that they are changing when it comes down to PvP. Battle Spirits. Currently on the live server, your damage taken is roughly around like 45%, but it is going to be bumped up to 55% decreased so the more you're actually trying to fight outnumbered you're going to be doing less damage to someone the longer you're trying to fight this person so like as of right now on the live server they take roughly like 45 percent less damage so when this new change comes about they're going to take 55 percent less damage and honestly i believe that we are going to be seeing a tank meta and I'm not talking about a heavy armor meta or anything like that. I'm talking about a tank meta. I'm talking about people rocking seven pieces of medium armor, vampire, and their block mitigation will be over 100%. Yes, I'm not joking. I'm not even playing. I have a little video at the end and everything showing my uh, Dragonite that I've been like playing around with on the PTS and everything, trying to see how much of a uh, block mitigation I can actually get. Currently, I am roughly at 130% block mitigation, and it, my block cost is only like 200 points, with like roughly around like 30,000 stamina, and I think my max health is like a little over like 40k, something like that. So I think it's going to be a little ridiculous when it comes down to uh, how uh, PvP is going to play out when it comes down to it in the future, um, at least for this next coming update. So I guess we're going to be rolling back out with uh, that block tank meta. So that's going to be fun. There are a few things that are going to be changing in the champion tree and everything, more so in the red tree. And pause the video as you see fit. Because, honestly, this is why I think we're going to be going into a block uh, tank meta type of situation with this next update. Um, and for those wondering about my Nightblade build that I have, do not worry. I am not changing a single thing with that setup. Gear is going to remain the same. The only difference is I am going to run Vampire on this next update. I haven't ran Vampire in a couple years, so it's going to be really interesting actually running Vampire. I'm going to run Stage 3 because I want to be able to have that 30% damage reduction when it comes down to it. And I'm going to change one thing in the CP tree and everything, and it's going to be I'm going to remove the points out of uh, the one that gives me health recovery uh, for however much ultimate that I actually have. And I'm going to be switching that one over to um, the one that gives me damage reduction, 10% damage reduction, if I have a status effect on my body. So that's going to help out quite a bit when you're trying to fight out numbered and everything, especially on the Nightblade and everything like that. So, and with running Vampire, health recovery is really not going to matter all that much, especially going all the way up to like stage 3. So... As I said, check out these new little stars, these new little champion points that we actually have going on. I think it's just going to be a little different. There, there's, there's some really interesting changes that are going to be happening when it comes down to like CP and everything like that. And I, and I enjoy a different variety of stuff. I know that I've said in previous videos and everything like that, 
that my blue tree hardly ever changes, my red tree never changes. There's a few things in the red tree that actually make me want to change a few things around, but not a whole lot. But the newest thing, honestly, in the red tree when we get over to it, really, really makes me think we're like we're going into that block mitigation, medium armor, 100% mitigation when it comes down to blocking. Like, and I'm really, uh, honestly, I don't know if there is a cap when it comes down to how much damage we can actually mitigate. Um, I just know what the stats read on the stat bar and everything like that. And then with the damage reduction that we're actually going to be getting in PvP itself and everything. And then with certain gear sets as well. Like, it's going to be outrageous. Like, this next coming update, you are going to see some tanky, tanky targets. And it's going to be outrageous. I haven't even attempted to try uh, a block tank on a uh, Necro. And this next coming update kind of really makes me want to actually see what it's going to be like running the same kind of setup that I have on this uh, Dragonite that's going to be showcased right at the end of the video. And actually just putting it on a uh, Necro and having him go full on Goliath mode, get like 90,000 health and just having him just stand there. Not even blocking. Because even on the video that's going to showcase the Dragonite and everything, I'm not even holding block on one of the little spots in my block mitigation. It's at 99.4%. Like, that's just outrageous. So that paired with, like, the undead for the vampire for stage 3, like, it's going to be outrageous. So I'm I'm looking forward to the next patch, but at the same time as a solo player, I'm actually not looking forward to it at the same sense. Which leads me on to like the next little bit of information. I am going to be playing New World. Um, the beta is going to be released, I believe, on the 20th of this month. So I will have some game clips of New World. I will be live streaming New World as well since I will no longer be under the NDA for uh, the alpha version of it and everything like that. So I hope you guys come in and check out the videos and come and check out the live stream. But until then, take care, you guys. Have a good one. Do not worry. I will release this block mitigation tank as soon as I am comfortable with it. And until then, take care.